Oh, holy smack, guys. It is literally freezing cold right now. I just walked downstairs, came in this room. So, first of all, in downstairs, it was freezing cold. And then I opened this door, and boom, a gush of air comes right at me. It's freezing cold in here. And my mom just turned on the heat, and I was like, oh, holy smack. So, we don't have the heat or the fan, I mean, or the air conditioning thing on, and what is it called? I think, yeah, I think it's called, like, an air conditioner system or the uh, heater on at night. Plus, we don't keep our down, we keep a fan, we have, like, a fan in our living room we, and, like, a ceiling fan, and we don't keep that on either. So, it should just be, like, warm down here and whatnot, and it shouldn't be super cold. But it is super cold, and it's freezing, and I'm so cold right now. So, sorry if I just get this chill. Well, chill out of nowhere because it's freezing cold. But, as you can tell by the title of the video, and the heater's on, so it should be getting hot soon. But, anyway, as you, as you can tell by the title of the video, this will be a What's in My Shower Caddy video. Um, so, yeah, and I'm really acting dumb right now because I'm wearing uh, some shorts and a like little gown, nightgown right now and it's freezing cold. Sorry, I keep getting off topic because it's so cold. Um, but it's getting warm here now that we have the heater on bumps through like, ooh. Anyway, let's just get into the video because this is going to be a What's in My Shower Caddy video. I hope you guys enjoy. I enjoy watching these videos so I hope you guys enjoy watching mine. I'm not trying to brand any shape of core. Uh, any shape, wait, and I'm not, yeah, any shape or form, I was trying to, I said core, but I was like, wait, is it form, form, what? Um, so yeah, any shape or form, so without further ado, let's just get into the video. Ugh, chow, this is my shower caddy, it is simply just a bucket, since it's not, since it's not summer anymore, of course I can't use it, so I just use it on my shower caddy. I got this from my, I used to go to this program called Big Brother Big Sister, um, but it was pretty much only Big Sister because the only people there was girls, uh, well, you know, the only adults there were girls, there were no big brothers, so yeah, and on the last day, since it was summertime then, they gave us these little Sion buckets, I decided they were a whole bunch of goodies, and it was so fun, and they gave other stuff, another uh, bag full of goodies too, and it was just so fun, so now I, not months later, I think almost like a, yeah, like a year, no, wait, yeah, months later, um, I can use it for my shower caddy, so that's why I got this. So, let me just show you everything that is inside. Okay, so the first thing that you will find in my shower caddy is this little sweet pea shower gel. I actually had this in one of my Bath and Body Works haul videos, so I'll keep the link down below if I remember to, in case you want to check it out. But this is just from Bath and Body Works. It only cost $5. Let's see. It only costs five dollars, and it's a little shower gel, Shea and vitamin E shower gel, and it smells so good. Uh, I have sensitive skin, so I can't really use it, but I have no other place to put it, so I just keep it in my shower caddy since it's a shower gel. But it still smells good, and I still, you know, can be like, oh, it smells good sometimes. So, yeah, I just got that. The next item in there is just this Lady Speed Stick Invisible Dry 24 Hour Protection Shower Fresh Deodorant. And it smells so good, and I love it, of course, since it's purple. So you definitely want to be smelling good. So now you got your own little deodorant, and it's just purple one. Well, so I have my own little deodorant in there. That's just a purple one. Then I got this little shower gel that I don't use for my, I mean, this little shampoo thing that I don't use for my hair. I use it for my dolls. Um, but, yeah, I got it from a family friend, but it has, like, fragrance and all those things in there that I don't use. Because I am natural, um, like, what? Oh, never mind, that's what was calling me. Anyway, I have natural African-American hair. So, um, this type of stuff that's in here isn't the really stuff that I like to use in my hair. So, this is just the Sue shampoo stuff. Whoa, it's cold. Um, but it's getting better. So, uh, this is just the Sue shampoo stuff. And, um, yeah, I don't really want to, like, use it on my hand. 
I mean, I'm a hair in it because it just doesn't really have the type of stuff in it. Like, I u normally use, like, it has, like, shan um, it has, like, fragrance and what else? Like, hope it has, like, fragrance and slash, like, perfume and a whole bunch of weird things that I, I never use. I never use this type of stuff in my hair. I most, but it's my suit, but I got it from my, uh, my third grade teacher in a gift basket because we were, like, pretty close or whatnot. Um, the type of stuff I use is this Shia Moisture one, the one that has, like, raw Shia butter, and it's, like, moisture retention shampoo, and it's with sea kelp and argan oil, and helps, like, dry damaged hair. I don't have dry damaged hair, but I still am going to start using this. It helps heal, grow, and strengthen your hair. It is, uh, color safe. It is something free, um, and sulet free. I don't know how to pronounce that, um. And it says like no, like no mineral oil, no anything in there. Um, just really nice straight out like shea butter, argan oil, and sea kelp. Sea kelp, sorry. That's all really good stuff for your hair, for like my type of uh, conditioned hair. So I really like this a little bit more than the soup. And I don't use this on my hair again. The soup I use that on my doll's hair. But I do use this one. I've never used it before, but I have to find time to use it in my hair. I use the one by Silky Elements. That's the one I use, that shampoo and conditioner. But, yeah. Um, this one is just another shower gel, and this is by Amari, which it smells so good. And I got this in a kit with, like, a powder and the perfume, lotion, all that stuff. And it's just a little shower gel. You can get these at Avon. By the way, but it's not by the brand Avon, but you can buy at the store thing Avon from the catalog Avon. And it's just this Amari thing, and it smells literally so good. So I just have that in there. Next, I just have these little small sample size soap. It's just really small. I picked this little um, small soap up at when I went to this hotel before. And it smells pretty good. It's just a little bar of soap. And I just keep it in there. I never use it. I just have nowhere else to put it. And I keep it there, for, I guess, for, like, memories or whatever. Just to have some a little knickknack from there. And then finally, yeah, that's, like, one of the final things. Finally, I have this face mask and this cleanser. So, I with my cleanser. It's just this Energen anti-blemish cleanser that I just found at the dollar store. Walking around the dollar store, I was like, ooh, look at a cleanser. I need that. And then I got it. So, uh, it, this helps to get clear and smooth. Yeah, clear and smooth skin. And it's just really nice. It's simply just a cleanser. And it's, like I said, it's by Energen. And it works really well. So, I just have that. And I use that every day to keep my skin nice and good. It's just I have sensitive skin, so I'm not get bumps. On my, my skin or on my face or whatever. I'm not huge one, but little tiny ones, so it doesn't really look bad. But uh, sometimes I get them, so that really helps out. And then every night I also use my mint um, face mask by Queen Helene, I think. And it's just come. It's a complexion solution, deeply cleans and refreshing is. And it's for oily and acne, it's oily and acne prone skin. I think it's for that or something. I don't know, but my mom picked me this up, picked this up for me from the store called CW Price. Um, I always used to get these, uh, buy, like, these packs for, like, $3. They, excuse me, they're separate packs, um, a face mask, and you just put them on your face or whatever. Um, and when I found, my mom found this tube of one that was mint, because I love the scent of mint. Then I was like, yeah! And sorry, my voice just went really weird right there, um. I don't know. I talk, my voice sounds really odd in the morning, by the way, so, yeah, I don't know what's wrong with that, but, what's wrong with that, but, yeah, but, um, this is pretty much all that's in my shower caddy. I know I said I was so cold so much in this video. It's not as warm -er now because we have the heater on now, but it was so cold, you guys literally don't know. I was like... Antarctica, watch out. We got something up on you. <laughs> we have something up on you. Uh, that's how I felt. But, yeah, it was freezing. But now it's warm, and I feel good. And, yeah, so let me put everything back in here. I'm just going to show you how I store it. So I'll just take my sand bucket. I take all my bigger items first. So, like, my cleanser, shower gel, my big Amari shower gel, shampoo. And then I'm going to take my little stuff, like my small shampoo. 
shower gel, deodorant, and all that stuff. Stuff that in the middle. And then, there's one little crack left. And that's where I just stuff my little soap at. So this is my entire sh my entire shower gel. It has a little handle on it, so it works very well. I really hope that you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Where's my mouse at? Okay. One minute. Okay, there we go. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.